Hi everybody, this is Jeffrey, this is Ripe Color, and this is your reading for February 2021 for Scorpio. Please like, subscribe, share, comment, press the bell for notifications. I'm offering 30 minute readings for $30. If you're interested, please be in touch. And uh, all the information is below. And uh, I hope you're doing well. It's currently January 22nd, and it's time to do February. Let's see what's going on. One more. Okay. One, two, three. Great cards. Great cards. Okay, one, two, three. Okay, aces are all about new beginnings. So this could be new financial beginnings, new beginnings in terms of security. I also, the way I love this card because you can see the path. There's a vortex you, you step through. So this could be like a new way of thinking. Can you see it? How do I unglare it? <laughs> the three is about creativity. It's about celebration. It's about community. So it might mean working with other people or having three different, um, three different uh, things in the fire. And then this is a great card. Okay. And then the last card is um, nine. So nines as a whole are about attainment and she's fantastic. So if I have to put this into one word, the word would be gain. The word would be gain. I'm a Scorpio too, so I'm really thrilled with this reading. <laughs> Let's see if I could pull some more good cards. <laughs> um, so this is the self-made, this is very entrepreneurial. This is about about this, she, it took her a long time to get here. It's the nine. So this is about the self-made woman. This is really about the self-made woman. You know, this is about, you know, her being, um, living in luxury in her garden, you know, and her garden's got everything. Her garden, this is about abundance and flow. And it's interesting that you have three and then nine. So, this could very easily be like a, um, you know, I don't always read the cards as this is a man, this is a woman, you know, because they're archetypes. Um, this is about like a collaboration. It's about creativity, about something that brings you joy. This could be working with other people. And, you know, working with other people doesn't mean you have to be in the same space with them. It could be all online. <laughs> um, it could be joining of three ideas. It could be two ideas becoming a third. It's a lovely card. Threes are always about creativity. It's a three graces. It's a three graces. It's a really, really positive, upbeat, um, move forward, be in the flow, be in the flow. This is really about abundance and gain. And, you know, it's very entrepreneurial and it's very uh, self-sufficient. And she's almost, and she's, and there's optimism and there's an intuitive quality to it because I always feel like the little bird is kind of like, you know, like something whispering in your ear. Oh, you should do that. You should do that. Work with this one. Don't work with that one. Try this instead. You know, maybe if you do it at a different time, maybe if, you know, you're offering physical goods, it's a, um, you do it in red, do it in pink, it'll tell you. So if you listen, you'll know where to go. So it's a really, really positive reading. Um, and this is for the month of February, which um, is wonderful. It's wonderful. You know, it's like, let's get this party started. Let's get this party started. 
also, you know, if you get this new idea of a new way to make money, um, you should definitely start talking to people about it, right? In order to manifest it. Nine is attainment. You know, even the negative nine, nine is attainment. Nine's a very magical number. It's really nice. It's really nice. Anyway, blessings to you. If you'd like a one-on-one, -on -one, all the information is below. Um, please visit my website, ripecolor.com. I offer tarot readings. I offer healing. I offer uh, t-shirts and scarves and paintings and blah, 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 blah. <laughs> La, 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 la. <laughs> I la uh, I should do uh, ad copy. All right. Blessings. Thanks for coming.